Oh, good. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, it's a shame. It's a shame that people at home miss hearing the band. There is a cross section of the best musicians in, uh, it's a who's who in jazz studio musicians in this band, and we almost never hear them play except these little dribbits, and that's the way it's going to stay. Oh. <laughs> No, but it's what I That's most a cold of what, shot, man. almost all of what I said was true. There was a man in the front row here pulling for me to get my note right. It was so <laughs> sweet. I um, I can't tell anybody, I guess, who's never tried it, and it's new to me, the sense of power there is when there's a band playing and you're singing. I never, I never had any kind of kick like it on stage. I mean, when when I am when I am singing, when a person is singing. Well, to hear a band playing and you're singing, it's a terrific thrill. You can't get anywhere else in life. Well, you, you, what, it, what it is, you have something to lean on. See, right away, yeah. if, you, if you get a good band, and I think you have a good band, uh, you get something to lean on. The only unfortunate thing, uh, uh, which is, uh, you know, each time I talk to you, I have the same complaint, not against you, but the same complaint with television, and that is the sense that when you do something, you know, everybody says, hey, look, this guy better come out here and he must entertain me. And this is right. I, I'm not against that. What yeah. I am against is that if, you, if you're going to be if you're going to be put on the spot where you must entertain, mm -hmm. then I think we really, you know, uh, uh, you must have the facilities for sound. Now, they got the visual. OK. Right. Yeah. Uh, the only thing is that my gripe is, is that I sell sound. I don't sell sight. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm, what you hear from mm -hmm. me, because the public, when they listen to me or they buy the records, they are listening to sound. And unfortunately, I, I'm yeah. still griping. I guess we're both going to be thrown off the air, sure, after the night. But <laughs> I'm still selling sound. I think the visual thing is cool. You hear all about the new stuff, how they can, you know, they can make you be in half and they can put one of your foot over on this side and your hand over here. Yeah. They can do all kind of tricks with you visually. But so far, the only uh, uh, problem I have with television is today, I got to tell you, is sound. Because really, yeah. uh, uh, when I put on a little tuxedo or whatever the hell I got on, I walk out on stage, <laughs> and, then, and the next thing I know, the guy says, hey, you're on, and I'm supposed to sound, not look good, sound. See, they can make me look good. Yeah. They have me looking like I'm 33 when I'm 45, you understand? That's all good. But I want, my thing is, I want to sound good. Well, why don't they make certain sets for people who are sensitive to sound with larger speakers? Well, There's because no television they, set well, has what, a very what, big what, speaker. The what, little dinky things. Well, like... now, what, what, what happens, I think, uh, i got to tell you, I really think that the, the, the problem is, is that in order to sound good, it, it calls for things that won't look good visually. That's right. You like, see? Like safety and, devices on cars. Yeah, you know? right, exactly. Yeah. You've got the same kind of thing. There's a compromise. And, and what I'm trying to seek is that I wish that they could get some kind of, uh, some kind of compromise between looking good and mm -hmm. sounding good. Because I think the people who hear an artist on television is really cheated. Because yeah. you don't really know how good they, they can really sound because you've got to sacrifice so much for the sake of visual. And some of them won't do any television for that reason, or just or the very well, minimum. Well, I, I tell guess. you, I, I mean, yeah. I fight like a dog, man, a, a, about this. Yeah, I, I really do. I, I go through all kinds of changes about the sound and everything. And the, th and the sad part about it, the artist, when he comes off sounding bad, the public walks away and says, wow, I saw Ray Charles, I saw whoever it was on TV. Yeah. And you know, I buy a lot of his records, but he sound bad. Like, they don't realize the, the, the hell you have to go through to do TV. Yeah. Really, I mean, it's a, I don't know why I've put you through this. Well, I'm sorry. You, <laughs> yeah, you got the band. The band is way uh, the the band is way away from me. But you see, if you put the band where I am, then it won't look good. That's right. You see, and that's just. Not to imply, fellas, that you guys look bad. Don't, don't miss <laughs> Not clear. the individual players, of course not. I want to make myself clear. Well, on we it. can put some kind of masks on them or something. <laughs> oh, please. I'm sorry, we got to take a message. We'll be right back. Hello. It's a good point. <laughs>